Let's be honest, government isn't known for quick work. People often joke about red tape and government working slowly. But here at the Riverdale Regional Park, things are moving at warp speed. Monday, this was an empty fairground. By early next week, FEMA will disinfect up to 80,000 pieces of personal protective equipment here every day. So when something as critical as this comes up, everyone put things aside and made sure that we addressed it right away. The lease was hammered out right away. And we also have worked with them to make sure that our building is up to specs. The first of seven trailers arrived on site this morning. A forklift moves each one into the exhibit hall. And inside each of these self-contained trailers, they'll be able to clean PPE, mostly masks, some face shields. They're sprayed with hydrogen peroxide mist before FEMA redistributes them to healthcare workers. The state says a single respirator can be reused up to 20 times. We are still at the height of this, and there's a potentially a second wave. So having an operation like this will benefit our local healthcare providers and keeping them safe is really the most important thing we can do. Senior Vice President of the Colorado Hospital Association, Julie Lomberg, calls the PPE supply chain interrupted and unreliable. She says, quote, anything we do right now to help ensure a long-term supply of hospital-grade PPE is critical. Allie Levine, 9 News.